Yes, so this is the solution to the question. They, so we had two reactants which um, were iron, 3 oxide, and aluminum. So we need to know what reactant will produce the least amount of the product. And based on our calculation, iron 3 oxide produce the least amount of aluminum oxide. And the right answer is 119.6. So what we did, the first step was a gram to mole conversion. So when we're doing a gram to mole conversion, we use the molar mass of iron trioxide. So that was why we had to bring in the mole on top and the grams at the bottom. The next step is the mole to mole conversion. So we were converting iron three oxide to aluminum oxide. And the only way we can do that is by using the mole ratio from the balanced chemical equation. The last step is converting aluminum oxide from moles to grams. So based on this calculation, we cancel these units this unit cancels this unit and this cancels this unit leaving our answer in grams or better still I could use different ink so we know what's going on then this cancels this and lastly this cancels this leaving our final answer in grams so it's the same thing we did here so we converted um, aluminium from grams to moles using its smaller mass then we converted the moles of aluminium to the moles of aluminium oxide using this um, coefficient from the balanced chemical equation then the last step was to convert from moles of aluminium to grams of aluminium leaving a final answer in grams however aluminium produced a greater amount of the product hence aluminium is the excess reactant but a final answer should be the least amount of the product produced that is why this is the correct answer.